12 best preserved fossils. Number 12. Some nerves. The fossil of a crustacean-like creature thought to be the ancestor of today's spiders and insects was discovered in 2016. The team of archaeologists that found the 520 million year old fossil say it displays one of the oldest and most detailed fossilized nervous systems ever found from the period. In fact, the creature's fossilized remains are so exceptionally preserved that individual nerves can actually be discerned. They were revealed after close examination of the fossil displayed tiny fibers branching out at regular intervals that were just five thousandths of a millimeter long, and those fibers were actually nerves. Because soft tissues and the nervous system are composed of fatty-like materials, finding them actually preserved as fossils is exceedingly rare. Number 11. So pollination is just for bees? Not so fast. There's another buzz created by some beetles, fossilized in amber, that suggests they may have played a role in pollinating plants. Researchers found the insects that lived some 45 million years ago were preserved with orchid pollen still in their mouths, which would indicate that the bugs were, once upon a time, important pollinators on Earth, not unlike butterflies and bees today. One toe-wing beetle from Mexico had orchid pollen, as did a hidden snout beetle discovered in the Dominican Republic. While some modern-day beetles are known to use orchids for nectar, no fossil evidence ever indicated them doing so in the evolutionary past. Number 10. Have a heart. The Santana Formation in Brazil yielded the fossil of a fish that was around 119 million years old and discovered the first ever example of a fossilized heart. Using a non-invasive x-ray imaging technique to look inside the creature, they created a 3D digital restoration of the organ for closer examination. Turns out the ancient creature had a more complex heart structure than its present-day relatives, possessing five rows of valves, something unseen in vertebrates of today. Over 25 species of fish have been found at the Santana Formation, as well as various reptiles, amphibians, plants, and invertebrates. Number 9. Well, it took a while, but a new species of ichthyosaur was identified in Nottinghamshire, England. Ichthyosaurs were large marine creatures that resembled sharks and dolphins, first appearing around 250 million years ago. The ancient fossil was actually laying in a British museum since 1951. Paleontologist Dean Lomax noted the specimen is mostly complete and consists of a partial skeleton that includes pectoral bones, limbs, ribs, vertebrae, and a skull. But the bones appear disorderly, likely due to the carcass nosediving into the seabed before becoming fossilized. That condition may have restricted previous study on the fossil. Number 8. Thalatosaur. The fossil of a rare prehistoric marine reptile was discovered by researchers in Alaska in 2011, and it's likely the most complete fossil of the creature called Thalatosaur discovered in North America. The long-tailed sea creature went extinct at the end of the Triassic period some 200 million years ago. Unlike most fossil discoveries of this species, this one had a nearly full skeleton. Very uncommon, considering only around a dozen full specimens of Thalatosaur exist in the world. The creatures were active in the seas for some 30 million years and measured up to 13 feet long, and up to a half of that length was contributed by the tail. Number 7. An extraordinary find. In southeast China, workers laying new sewage pipe were surprised to discover a clutch of fossilized dinosaur eggs at their work site. 43 eggs were discovered, 19 of which were completely intact. The giant fossils each measured around 10 to 12 centimeters in diameter. The red sandstone beds in which they were found are thought to have preserved the fossils so well. After one worker was restrained while trying to abscond with an egg, onlookers formed a human chain about the site until authorities arrived and the fossils were safely transported away. Since 1996, more than 17,000 fossilized dinosaur eggs have been discovered in China. Now what would you do if you found an egg like that? Number six, rocks on the locks. If you're feeling old, check out this rock. It contains well-preserved fossils of life forms thought to have lived over a billion years ago. That's billion with a 
B. These fossil-bearing rocks were found on the edge of a remote Scottish loch or lake in 2011, and it's thought the life forms once lived at the bottom of lakes a billion years ago. While considered primitive, these organisms had specialized cell structures, including a nucleus, and could reproduce sexually, helping to speed up evolution. Scientists believe that land plants and green algae ultimately evolved from these organisms. Number 5. Scorpion fossil, an amazing fossil discovery said to have been found by a farmer in a dirt pit dug by hand. This two centimeter male scorpion was unearthed in the amber-rich Chiapas highlands of Mexico. Fossilized scorpions are rare, let alone complete ones. Taking a close look at these pictures by Francisco Riquelme, and sorry if I messed up that name, but it revealed the entire body of the scorpion perfectly preserved in amber. From one angle, its tail seems poised to strike like the animal could suddenly spring to life and burst out of its ancient tomb. The detail and clear features are really amazing. The specimen is tentatively dated between 15 to 23 million years old and is considered a new species. Did you know more than 258 scorpion species have been found in Mexico? Number 4. Fossilized eggs the size of a button are said to contain the remains of the world's oldest lizard embryos. Discovered in Thailand in 2015, scientists were able to peer inside the eggs by using synchrotron X-ray scanning, and it appeared the embryos were ready to hatch at the time of their death. Researchers had expected to find remains of a primitive bird species or perhaps a small dinosaur inside the eggs, but finding the ancient lizards was unexpected. About the size of sparrow's eggs, they're hard-shelled, which is considered unusual for lizards. Dated at 125 million years ago, the eggs belonged to a lizard related to the Komodo dragon, which lived during the Cretaceous period. The ancient lizard species has yet to be known. Number 3. In 2015, Outback Queensland was the site of a huge haul of fish fossils that dated back a hundred million years. But one fish fossil in particular stood out. Details in the fossil were so clearly defined, you can even make out its eye socket. No wonder it caught so many people's eyes. That fish was a kuyu and measured nearly 10 feet long with teeth around an inch long. It also had a powerful tail and researchers think it probably targeted larger fish. While scientists were jubilant about the find, the kuyu doesn't seem all that happy. Then again, if you were fossilized for a hundred million years, maybe you wouldn't feel like whooping it up either. Number two, even if you don't like insects, you might feel for this creature trapped in Burmese amber ages ago. This is a female scale insect from the Mesozoic period, and she's carrying 60 eggs on her back in an effort to protect her offspring. In Bo Wang's photo, you can see the eggs and freshly hatched nymphs encased in a wax-coated egg sac located on the insect's abdomen. This is actually the earliest evidence of insect brood care that dates to at least a hundred million years ago. It's a way of protecting the young from inclement conditions as well as from natural enemies. This amber fossil is very unique since fossilized examples of such animal behavior are exceedingly rare. Number one. Alberta, Canada's Dinosaur Provincial Park is known to have one of the world's richest deposits of dinosaur fossils in the world. In 2010, paleontologist Philip Curry discovered what might have been the find of his career. It was a baby Chasmosaurus, the first intact fossil of its kind with a near complete skeleton. Only the creature's arms are missing, thought to have been eroded away thousands of years ago by a sinkhole. You can see the incredible detail in Clive Coy's picture here. The skull in particular is notably intact, as is the vertebra. The horned, plant-eating Chasmosaurus was a relative of the Triceratops and grew to around 16 feet long. Curry's discovery measures around 1.5 meters long and died 72 million years ago, thought to have been about three years old at the time. Because larger animals usually ate or destroyed smaller dinosaurs, it's likely the Chasmiosaurus was preserved away from predators in a riverbed before drowning. 